Good morning from the aftermath of Leipzig book fair. You can see all of the big boxes behind me. Well, it goes on and on and on in that direction because now that we had to get the restock, I actually need to really make sure to count what I have here so that the online shop numbers are correct because we kind of stuffed everything we had left in the studio into my car to get as much out of Leipzig book fair as possible. And it was a really big success. I'll do like a full recap review in a second. It's going to be part of this vlog. I'll also show you my hall, which is over at my apartment. I'm here in my, my art studio space. Well, studio space, it's, it's my storage space, I guess, because I don't really draw here at all anymore. All I do is come here to pack orders and prepare for conventions. These are all of the schrocks I have left. And it should be enough for all of the open online shop orders. I made sure to set those aside before we completely sold out at Manga Comic Con in, at Leipzig Book Fair. Because we are now fully sold out of the Kaltzifer socks, the Schrocks, the Dark Spirit No Face socks. We are low on the Eye socks, on the Gaming socks. Those are out in the smaller size. The Koi Pond socks, the Samurai socks. So all of my best-selling sock designs are out. And I have an event in two weeks and there's no way a restock will arrive in time. But the good thing about that event, it's Animuk, there will be a vlog about it here as well soon in a bit, is that the table is so tiny anyways that I wouldn't have had space for them. So actually I'm relieved. I also just got notified that the dress shirt restock, so the restock of the free designs that I have, as well as the new samurai design, which I already have a sample for, but since it's a different type of sewing and printing, it took longer to produce, that those are on their way. I'm super happy about it. And I also just asked for a quote to get some new shirts designed because I want some long-sleeved ones for, uh, for Dokumi. They should arrive for Dokumi, I hope, if I finish the designs this week. And then also in this vlog, I just got here. It is 9 a.m. I had a bunch of emails in my inbox, so that's why I'm talking so fast. I need to get so much done. I am heading to Berlin in a few hours at 3 p.m. We are off for a week of relaxation and looking at my inbox work as well because I have one of the big client projects I do every year is the poster for the video and film target which is a youth film festival organized by the city of Vienna and they do these huge advertisements for them in all of the subway stations and on poster stands in the city and the deadline for that is really really soon so I need to get the sketches done hopefully today in the train to Berlin and send them off so that that works out, hopefully. And if it doesn't, I don't know what to do. But I also got a wholesale order for the Samurai Museum in Berlin. I'm gonna pack that in a second, because I'm going to Berlin, I can just drop it off in person. I hope I have enough of the stuff in stock here with me. I'm gonna write the invoice, I'm gonna pack my online shop orders. I've been talking for three minutes. Ah, I don't have time for this.
Good morning from Berlin. I am now on the way to the Summerland Museum since they have a lot of my stuff, including these collar pins. In the museum gift shop, so I thought I'd visit them and see how their current collection looks like, what other things I could offer them to have. I actually did a design for them recently, an illustration for of one of their arms, which is similar to this arm, which is on the shirt that I designed, which can be made in my shop, and they're finally arriving soon. And yeah, it's a 40 minute subway ride because everything in Berlin takes absolutely ages to get to, but at least there's good food on the way and I can listen to music. So that is what I'm going to do now. And afterwards, I need to start continuing the whole, no, the summer museum also did a wholesale order with me last week, which I didn't have time to pack and bring them, so I'm going to send it to them next week. But what I need to do is the commission illustration that I have for the extra for the video and film, film festival, new film festival. They got back to me, I did the designs on the train, like three different sketch designs, and they chose one of them. So now I can say, look at the changes they have and send it to them in the next three or four days. We really do not know what the it's going to be. Yeah, I hope you can hear me on this side and walk along with the stairs. I'll see you in a bit. And I'm finally back from Berlin. I am back at home. And this is going to be the quick wrap up. I'm going to show you the haul for all of the things I bought at Leipzig Book Fair. I'm just going to play some music and add the Instagram handles to the screen because I filmed all of these clips in a rush last night. And then I'm going to just tell you that I had an absolute blast at Leipzig Book Fair. It was one of the most intense conventions I had with the restock and my partner bringing me more stuff overnight so we can make it work. But I shattered all of my convention records for a four-day convention. I'm definitely going again, even though it is definitely not a beginner-friendly convention. The opening hours are long because it's four days. The hotels in the area are quite expensive. The booth I had cost 1,600 euros. And even the small raffle tables are over 300, 400 euros now. So you will not have your costs below 1,000 if you have to travel and have a hotel and travel expenses and the booth. My expenses were closer to two, two and a half grand, which is a lot, especially if you also need to pay a helper, etc., etc. So it was a very rewarding con, but not one that I would immediately say go to and apply to for a good time. It is fun as a visitor, though. I really like the, the team that they really listen to feedback and they make sure that everything works well. They hand out like a survey at the end and collect it to make sure that everything was was good and that they can improve for the next time there's a very active discord where the mods and the convention organizers are in and they answer any questions so that was really a great experience i think that's about it i'm already preparing for animuk which will be next week's uh, convention vlog so stay tuned for that and until then i will see you next time you can find all of my art on my other social media accounts and good night <laughs>